What's up guys and welcome back to my channel if you are new to follow me and also subscribe to my youtube channel and today we are starting scars above and this is episode one um now we didn't go through the introduction but the great the game crashed we do the whole freaking luckily we just watched the introduction this video and then it crashed after Personal we read lock. everything Mission so specialist Kate Ward. let's Sentient just get back into it and response team We always wondered if we're alone in the universe. We observed and explored, but found nothing. Until now. Scar mission control to Hermes. Status check. All systems nominal. We're working on a solution for our scan power requirement. We'll update soon. Roger that, Hermes. Keep us posted. Kate, we have an issue. Problem with the scan? We've underestimated the power requirements necessary to penetrate the Metahedron's hull. Mike has an idea, but he could use a hand. He's in the lab and I'll give you the details. On my way. Well, that was fun, wasn't it? We got to this point where we started reading all the notes and the game crashed. Not even like five minutes into the damn thing it crashed. Okay, we read everything before it crashed, so I'm not gonna bore it here. It has been six months since the alien object known as the Metahedron suddenly appeared above Earth. Metahedron. The Hermes mission is currently making preparations to engage with it and attempt contact. Earlier this morning, we managed to snatch an exhaustion with the Don't miss it. Hey, Kate. I think I figured out a way to give us the power Mike. we need for the scan. I've attached the scanners directly to the engines. Wow, directly? Brave. I think it'll work, but we need to find a way to kickstart the process with around 500,000 volts. Do we still have those SLD-26 welders in the equipment room? Yeah, I think we have one or two, but why do you... Oh! Oh! You want to modify it to discharge high voltage electricity. Assemble the high voltage device in the lab. <laughs> oh boy. Okay, I hope the game doesn't crash again. <laughs> that was unfortunate. I didn't even play any combat when it crashed. Oh, shit. I'm supposed to open it manually. SLD-26 welder, standard space mission equipment. These welders are made specifically for repairing outer layers of modular space stations. Using the latest laser technology, they utilize a high energy beam to fuse materials together. They are efficient and easy to use. Now I need to craft a rail module at the mobile printing unit. Craft a rail module. Hold X to craft. Ooh. There. It should be strong enough to direct and focus the electrical current. Assemble the high voltage device in the lab. Okay. Now to fit all this together. A power source. I have to adjust the frequency of the Tesla coil first. I, yeah, I never leave my home planet without him. Ooh. Nice. That reminds me of the Batman games when we had to hack into stuff. Now, just to calibrate the output voltage. Oh, oh no! That looks like a space blaster. Just goddamn WWE kickout pin system over here. Accelerator discharging electrical Vera. Let's call it Vera for short. 
You sure like to name things. <laughs> Vera it is. Construction with trophy earned. Go to the engine room and boost the reactor's energy. Hold L2 to aim and R2 to fire. Oops. Yes, keep it up. Shit. Oh, I have to reload, really. Almost there. We need a little more energy for the reaction. Huh. Let's try a direct shot to the core. Straight to the heart. A direct shot to the core might do the it's working. I'm feeding the excess power directly to the scanner. I haven't seen you shoot like this since the college rifle championship. Yeah, I also Turn Vera to the equipment room. And don't you forget it. Good job. Dr. Ward, Dr. Yoshida, get to the bridge, please. Time to see what's inside our alien guest. That never goes wrong. Every time a game starts like this, so you just think you're gonna find out Rich info. Everything goes south. She served her purpose. Go to the bridge. Telemetry check. Telemetry check. Here go. How are we doing with that sensor array, Mike? We're ready, Commander. You have the honors, Dr. Warden. Take your place when ready and start the scan. Look at that. Holy shit, that looks good. No, there's always Excess energy there's a lot of space genes and metahedron. Of its I need to remember to metahedron. In just a moment, Doctor Ward. Team, can I have your attention, please? How would we? Since the dawn of humankind, our species has gazed toward the skies and wondered whether we were truly alone. Well, six months ago, we got our answer. With it came new questions. What is this object in front of us? Where did it come from? Who sent it? And why? While the governments, leaders, thinkers, and common people discussed the meaning of this event, we were training. We were preparing. The SCAR team. Now, the whole world is relying on us. We're dreamers and skeptics. We're explorers and pioneers. With hearts and minds. With courage and resolution. With trust and fellowship. With science. We're going to give the world their answers. And in this historic moment, at the conjunction of hopes and fears, there's no people I'd rather face the unknown with. Dr. Ward. You have the honors. Let's do this. Yes, Commander. She has a huge nose. <sighs> Scared? Of course I am. I thought you army pilots were trained not to be. Wait. We're trained to control it. Oh, the, the models have the exact same nose. How are you holding up, Doctor? Oh, I'm 100% sharp, all right. So, do you think it's a weapon? Well, a weapon is a very human concept. Not a Perhaps what we perceive as a weapon is just a tool. Wait, a scan. The metahedron's energy levels are rising rapidly. <gasps> okay, what happened? Power supply failing. Sensors offline. I'm switching to backup generators. I'll try to reroute. 
Look, the metahedron, it's, it's creating some sort of a gravity well. The Hermes is being pulled towards it. Hang on, everyone. Dr. Ward. Kate! Ooh, what was that? Like a big ass monster almost. All weapons with the same elemental properties about hours reading that game. Okay, so we just wake up. I thought we were gonna see the crash. Commander Robinson? Tam? Mike? Anyone? Where are you? What is this place? Every time I see green water, Dark Souls has trained me to think it's poison. What's happening? What the heck? I would love to run, but I do want to take in the environment as well. Physical strain drains your stamina. Wait. New entry added. Press circle to climb. Spirit reload. Strange planet. The last thing I remember from the Hermes was starting the scan of the Metahedron. There was a blast and the next thing I knew I woke up alone in a strange planet. I met a strange apparition. It seems to be guiding me somehow. I feel I should follow it and uncover what it has to show for me. Um, we did read all of this when the game crashed. Oh, we can dodge. Elden Ring Simulator. Yeah. I don't have a gun or anything though. Ooh, look at the planets in the background. Okay, so I can see this is just gonna be like a main, like a story game. However, I saw combat is similar to Returnal. Yo, that reminds me of the goddamn eclipse from Dark Souls 3. How is this possible? Holy shit. What planet is this? Did the Metahedron bring us here? That looks so good. I have no idea where I should be going. How's triangle do happen? Circle is to roll. That's gonna be a lot of fun for sure. That looks like it takes me down. Follow. Cool. I guess we're going this way then. <laughs> Yeah, this way has nothing. This is a very open land. I'm guessing I'm going to that thing in the middle. Some 
sort of alien structure. I'm just trying to take a look around. Yeah, apparently not. Interact with objects. Whoa! Holy shit! Escape the mysterious storm. Operation he destroyed us. I have no idea which way I should be going. What the? F Here keeps you sharp. Scar emergency signal detected. A scar emergency signal. It must be someone from the team. Holy shit, where is this? I have to get um, okay, we do have an inventory. Entity inside the storm. The operation led me to a console in the middle of an empty field. It warned me about the dangerous entity I attached the console and a terrible storm started. The sound was deafening as the storm raged on. I saw a huge, terrifying figure up and woke up in what looks like a swamp. Refill held unlimited amounts of ammo but also respawns enemies. Remove barriers will not. Okay, I see. So this is like a goddamn bonfire, huh? That's cool. I like that. At least it's not exactly like Returnal. <laughs> if you die, you start all over. It's from the Hermes. It, it must have splintered off when the ship entered the atmosphere. Ooh. Scar will be back. <sighs> Empty, but still useful. Electric so cutter. Electric can cut through even the toughest materials. I'd better take it with me. Inventory and examine. Examine. Ooh. Well, how do I? Ah, nice. Don't mind me. We are just doing some gardening at the moment. What the? Hold X near the body of a dirt a downed opponent, scanning for resources and information. Log entry. A joint. Of course, the first. Fucking thing to come against is a spider. Arachnid Jumper. Although small, these creatures usually overwhelm their prey with their poisonous attacks and large horns. I. Oh, there's an audio? Log entry. A joint legged invertebrate life form, similar to Arachnida. Fast movement, small frame. Seems to move in groups. That's cool. At least we're gonna get low on everything. I love that. Yo, I don't think I have a targeting system. They're dead. I need to remember I can dodge. What are you? Log entry. This plant doesn't have any clothes. Swamp finds of the vegetation is very durable and difficult to cut. The growth cycle is very short, which means the weeds can regrow themselves very quickly. Sky Fraser of Frisia. I don't know how you pronounce that one. The strange plant ex exudes a calming scent from its bizarre buds, numbing the sensomotor functions. Log entry. This plant doesn't have any chloroplasts, which means it can't conduct photosynthesis. Strange. 
Obtain six extra. How do I scan? Oh no, we have stamina! I guess this is like a Soulsborne game. Um, I just want to have a look around properly before we go. I don't want to like miss any lore or anything. Must be a gate of some sorts. There's no obvious locking lock entry. The gate has an internal. The alien gate. Lock entry. The gate has an internal conduction system. The three points on the rim seem sensitive. A targeted blast of electricity could cause a reaction. Oh, so she's saying the exact same thing, so we don't need to come into it the entire time. Electric ammo. Interesting. We yet to find a gun for it. So I guess we're gonna go all the way to find Vera, maybe? That's what I can think of. I open you. Here's the beacon. The current. Just a bit. We don't want to fry the coil. There. Awesome. We did it, Kate. I remember this. Mike and I were finishing our electrical experiment just after lunch. Oh, is this the weapon? Ho oh, ho, yeah. It's still intact. Give that shit to me. Why was something... Oh, it was that thing. So, how do I switch back to... My... Electric cutter. Ah, I see. Okay, you just press R2 to use it then. Yo! Let's get the shit. That is poison if I've never. What the hell was that? Log entry. Salivary glands concentrated in the head enable the creature to discharge a venomous secretion. Yep, venomous secretion. Highly susceptible to fire. Okay, so we don't need to listen to the audio. We already listened to it. However, um, arachnid scorpion, half arachnid and half reptile, its venomous spit is almost as deadly as its sharp claws. So facing it comes with a price. I love that you can actually see them moving when you're looking for lore. So I have to shoot this, I'm guessing. to use our melee weapon and try and save it and okay so now we're gonna come across dodging trying to make sure I don't go near the venomous 
Toxicity. Ah, it builds up at the bottom. Deals small amounts of damage over time and reaches 100%. Most of the other effects can be removed by using a resistance booster. Strange alien of new ways. Transfer. This means it has the potential to send information directly to the brain. Okay, so the information is very similar to what she said. They just word it differently. Yo, there's a big one. I'm gonna stab it. Triangle to heal. Okay. Oh, I couldn't freaking dodge because we in deep water. The chemicals in its I'm definitely okay. Hey. Oh man, exploding shit. Fiber, 3D printing, structural components or crafting. Okay. Anywhere where I can get ammo. Ah, here we go. Nice. What is that? Oh shit, did I pick it up already? I can't pick up any more? Oh, at least we can come back and get it. Another one of these pillars. Are you guys friendly? Oh. Approach pillars to use them as a respawn point in case you die. Um, interacting with pillars replenishes your health, ammo, power, and stamina and respawns enemies. This has no effect on the amount of resources you carry. Activate. We've got Hermes cables. Do I shoot these? Oh, I just wasted the freaking ammo. I have to break through it. Log entry. Strong organic tissue, but the blisters appear to be filled with diethyl ether. Most likely flammable. Yo, what the hell? What was that? Find a way through the tissue web and I guess we're gonna find something. Ability point. Um, spend ability points in the xenobiology and engineering branches. Um, as Kate progresses on her journey, she'll unlock new personal abilities. Holy shit! Increases stamina. When a weapon runs out of ammo, 25% of the clip will be replenished after 5 seconds. I'm guessing this is health. Yeah. Personal. Kate is trained. I don't know what... Biomass combining. Let's maybe get health up. Next one we'll do stamina. Oh, it's this thing that's moving. Yeah. Hermes um, cables, do I follow the cables I'm guessing then? Wow. 
side, though. You can hear things crawling inside these damn eggs. Scorpio cocoon. The outer layer of the cocoon protects the developing organism inside, judging by the amount of protein present in the placenta. The development pace of the creature inside is far quicker than anything found on Earth. Okay, you have to shoot in the face. I did not mean to freaking... Let's go. Open up. Show me your face. So I wonder if they do open automatically if you run fast or they only open when you try to destroy them. What is this? Polium. This complex plant consists of intricate chains of short polypides, which suggest enhancing effects to cognitive abilities and focus. Maybe heard that. Oh, oh is this flammable? Ah. Ah, I see. This equipment, it, it's from the Hermes, but we were there just an hour ago. I wonder if time is different here. Yeah. The whole place is covered with some kind of organic residue. Log. Contains information about your mission. Holy shit! Of notes about the pillar outside. Commander Richard Robinson, log entry. Ever since I left the Hermes, I, it's been getting worse. The growth. I have to get it off. I've, I've salvaged some electrical components. I might be able to craft an incendiary device with the MPU. <laughs> Burn the growth! The body must be cleansed! Ever since he left the Hermes, but we were just there. He, he sounds different. Enraged. Oh, okay. We have to craft it. That makes more sense. Yes, I can print a custom emitter with the MPU, connect it with the thermic module, and attach it all to the welder spring. Weapons. Different weapons can trigger certain effects on enemies, such as burn, poison, slow. I hope to get through otherwise impassable obstacles. Um, pay attention to the effect icon and the bar on top of the target. The icon changes when the bar is full and the effect is triggered. Sniper straight through that flesh-like webbing. And I'm taking the MPU. New personal ability. 
mobile printing unit. Helps Kate craft various items, attack and consume. We can reset ability points. I'm guessing we're gonna get enemies now, which we can test the fire thing on. Oh, we can burn the cocoons before they hatch. We just like save here and then go through it. I want to take chances, you know. So do I shoot these things? Oh, it's a flamethrower. Or not. Let's hold it in. I want to test it on an enemy. How do I get that? <laughs> Arachnid Scorpio's head. The head was violently ripped from the body. This must have been a vicious battle between two creatures. Um, probably a territorial war. The fact that the Scorpion lost its head doesn't necessarily indicate it lost the fight. Try hold what finger. This is where I'm going to find a data cube. Yes. Okay, so knowledge is how we get ability points. Oh shit. Yo, 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 yo! I should have just shot the damn pods before they came out, that would have been better. Okay. Find another cube. I guess we can make our way back down. I don't see the energy points on this gate. Perhaps they're on the other side. Oh, so a shortcut, huh? Oh, there's bones at the bottom. Pile of bones. Um, skeletal remains of a feral organism with most of the flesh dissolved. Bone marrow is rich with carbon. Mana to the... How far would you go in the search for answers? Ooh, it's not speaking English. Not a cave, almost. Oh, I can't collect it if I'm just above it. It's gonna take a while to... So you get like 30-40 for a brand new enemy. And for... Cubes, it gives you like 10. Holy shit! I'm gonna have a heart attack. I think it just popped out of nowhere. Resistance booster. Consumables. Hold L1 to select the consumable in the lower left. Place it in a quick slot and can be used by pressing R1. 
Mm. That's literally the only consumable I have. What the hell is that? Electrical attacks spread electricity across red surfaces. And now we have to wait for this man's aroma to freaking leave. Else we're gonna get toxicated. I do not wanna waste my file on. Thank you. There's something else in the water. Oh! I need to remember to dodge. Taking so many chances with standing still. I have to go up there. Something's gonna jump out. I just know it. Nice right, healing injection. Another boarding yeah? I have cataloged all of the medical supplies for our mission. Potent stuff. Boosters, stimulants, bio enhancers. I know our mission will have plenty of unknowns, but Wait for toxicity to run out. Why is it? Is this the way I should be going? If that's the case, then. I'm talking about so much right now. What is those things on the top? I don't have health. I think this is where I was supposed to go, yeah. So what was that other section then? Let's go take a look because we might be missing a data point if maybe it had one there. It was up here I think. Yeah, we missed this. Ammo catch. Robinson's army compass. Uh, Army issue field compass Robinson believes that this along with the fire starting kit is enough to give one a fighting chance in the wilderness. Out the glass is cracked and beyond repair. The needle is stationary as if it is not in the 
Still on. Nice, 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 nice. So we're not gonna take it, we're just leaving it there? Unless maybe he left it knowing that we're also gonna follow the same path as them. That a big ass pillar. How far would you go? There's a gun really, I guess. Robinson's backpack. Oh shit. He was here. I should look around and try to reconstruct his movement. Robinson must have lost balance and grabbed this rock. Seems like he had trouble walking. Carnivorous worm like organisms secreting acidic saliva. It would melt my suit and my flesh in moments. And I guess we're not going in there. They are reconstruct. Okay, Batman Arkham Knight. Definitely Batman Arkham Knight. So cool. So cool. He had issues walking, but pushed himself into the worm infested water. The worms converged on him. They seemed to fuse with his body. What happened to you, Richard? His signal is on the other side. Somehow he got through the worms. I won't last a moment, but I must find a way across. Let's go open the shortcut first. I can see the energy points on the gate from this side. Shortcut straight there. That's cool. That is cool, cool. Shit, can I even walk in this water? It's a bit too late now. What? I do not understand. way past the worms. So I'm guessing we're gonna walk all the way around if we end up going this way. Shall I go and see what was the thingy with this main thing in the middle? Okay guys, just give me a second, I need to go open the door for my father.
back, ladies and gentlemen. Log entry. Seems like this part of the structure is the command panel, but I'm not getting any energy readings from it. It must be deactivated. Oh, egg. Lava in its early stages of development, secreting cryogenic enzymes, glands responsible for this reaction are the first to fully develop. Oh, so we found a new type of ammo. But we haven't found something to craft it as yet. Cool. So I guess we are definitely going that way. That is about. I don't have help. I should probably go in, rest, and then come this way. Have health again. It costs 20 fiber. Oh, so the fiber we pick up is how we heal and shit. I see. Restores ammunition. That's kind of cool then. Okay, so I figured out how we use the fiber at least. Weak points. Hitting different body parts will result in increased, decreased damage and sometimes will even provoke different enemy behaviors. Some weak points are color coded and can only be broken with enough damage from a specific type. Electric damage, bright blue, heat damage, orange. Are we gonna fight something big? There's a huge area. Come on. Are you blocking? That correctly. I am missing the spot that I need to hit. There we go. I hit it on the last moment. The aggressiveness of these creatures is beyond typical territorial behavior. Is something causing such a state? Exo alluvial. I could not aim and hit that thing properly in the middle though. These walking mountains appear to have been extremely resistant to outside damage, save for a couple of weak spots on their head and stomach. Knowledge gained. 
So that was like kind of our first boss fight, maybe. Or mini boss. Fiber, max capacity. Interesting. Which way do I go now? Exposed pipes, high pressure, plant well model. So they weaken when exposed to acid. Oh, 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 I, I thought that was normal water. I freaking thought that was normal water. To that. Oh, it's another one of. Oh, damn, man. I'm going to die. To, I need to start dodging properly. Oh no, do we have to fight the other big one again as well? Okay, so we break its arm. And that will give me some leverage over it at least. It's not that way. That way is hell on earth. Let's go, my beautiful friend. I'm getting the hang of it now. Oh, I could have burnt it. You kidding me? I 
Are these? Something down there as well. What the hell? Freaking King Kong. <laughs> Species. The gigantic insectoid creature seems to be feeding on the organic matter in its surroundings while being able to repel other parasites with toxins secreted from its land. Okay. We're gonna have a gun. Ooh, are we gonna be able to freeze enemies though? yourself so we obviously have to find the part in order to craft the part of the gun oh we're over here okay before we save let's just take a look at Logs. Log entry. The creature's carapace is underdeveloped. If I find a mature specimen, I might be able to utilize their freezing secretion. Log entry. This creature is covered with a protective layer consisting of sedimentary rock from the surrounding area. Its exposed heart is filled with highly flammable bodily fluid. Log entry. Seems like this part of the structure is the command log entry. Okay, so it is the exact same thing then. Let's look at our abilities. So I also got more protein. This increases healing of a heal charge. Consumables cost 20% less. Oh, we need the killing blow. So, do I want to get stamina, I guess? Let's go with stamina. Cool. Okay. With that being said, guys, let us use this pillar. I right, cool. With that being said, I think I'm going to end this episode of Skies of Bubble here. I'm gonna take like a two to three hour break because we were playing Apex earlier. And I will be back and we can go again. Probably two or three hours. So thanks for watching. 
um, follow if you're new, subscribe to the YouTube channel, and I'll see you guys next time.